You just know exactly what to do when you see it. Cutting hair has become second nature for Walter Hill. The Boston native has been doing it since he was 11 years old. He's now owned several of his own shops, including one location with historical significance. 33 Washington Street, right on the Freedom Trail. Hill is the first and only black barbershop owner along the Freedom Trail. You know, when a lot of people were being sold on that, on that, on that chopper block at City Hall on the Freedom Trail and now things are changing, you're able to have a business and be good at your business and everybody being able to recognize it. It's a distinction partially shared by Shelly Mendez, the only black hair salon owner on Newberry Street. I figured if I didn't belong here, I wouldn't last here. And here it is 20 years later and I'm still here. Mendez has a large and loyal clientele, which includes Brenda Rodriguez. Brenda's a longtime client. She's been going to Salon Monet for 15 years and says if she didn't, she'd have nowhere else to go. Unfortunately, um, in 2023, it's still the case that um, some places you go to across Boston or on Newberry Street, um, will, they cannot do our hair. Both Hill and Mendez have taken it a step further, also prioritizing the connections they make with their clients, which keeps them coming back. Just a, a safe space to talk about the stuff you wanted to talk talk about my clients and I we open up and we talk about things within like not just here but some of their personal things and everything they share with us stays right here both hairstylists say even though they have a black hair salon and barber shop they are confident they can do every hair texture and hope more stylists will follow suit in the newsroom Danae Bucci WCVB News Center 5